along the fence row at the cornfield. I've got three snares set here. Nothing in them today. There's my last snare down by that fence post. So we're going to head back now to the truck and uh, drive on back through the rest of the farm. Check the uh, snares and the footholds. See, see what's up with those. See if there's any activity, what have you. Now keep you posted. Okay. Tommy's got a red fox in his foothold. And today I got my son Ben. How you doing? His daughter Lainey, my Hi. granddaughter. And she's going to go over here and pet this fox. That was a good catch. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, if this is a female, we're going to let this female loose because it is February 6th. You should have been able to tell there. Yeah, I think it is female. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to give the camera to Ben. Okay, what we're doing here, um, we're actually setting basically for coyotes, and it's February the 6th here, so we, uh, we said that any female red foxes that we catch, we will go ahead and let loose. So we're going to go ahead and uh, let this one loose. Okay, so we're going to let her loose. Boy, she's really hurt. Running right up to my snare. She hit it. <laughs> I hope she didn't get in my snare. <laughs> Let's go see. Alrighty. Oh, she's been right off the trail with the snare on it. Oh. You got that pine tree here. <laughs> you might have, she is in it. <laughs> she ran right into your snare. <laughs> go get my stick. She ran right into the snare. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? She ran right into the snare. Oh. Oh my goodness. Better hold the camera. Well, here, kid, you want to hold the camera and video for us again? Just keep a good, steady hand. Come to me. Take it over. Watch it. Honor? Yeah. Okay, we're going to try to let her go again. Ready? All right. <laughs> hey, this time she's not going to die. There we go. Isn't that just funny? That just tells you that this was a good trail. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. All right, we'll just reset and ready to go. Of course, she was only in it for about a minute.
Okay, there's that one. Okay, hey, thank as you. I said before, uh, we're basically trapping for coyotes um, and some of the farms, male foxes, because the farmers want them gone. But uh, this farm here is uh, not a working farm, so he's not killing chickens or anything like that. And we do trap this year after year, so that'll lead us some seed for next year. What do you think, kid? Okay. You, you, you got to see the first time a fox was let go out of the trap and ran straight in a snare. Okay, caught a coon. Well, as you can see, caught a coon here in this snare. And he maxed it out. There is no more trail except coming right through the fence right there. So I don't know how I'm going to work this. We'll try. Okay, you remember what the tour upset looked like? Here is the remake. There's the trail. Original trail goes right to where the snare is. Went ahead and blocked it in on the sides with brush. And some other things there. So here you go. They come through the fence. Hopefully uh, we'll grab them. Hey folks, this is JW again. Just left uh, one of our farms where we're trapping on and we caught a big coon. I think I just showed you the reset of that. Uh, now we're headed over to the 250 acre plot where we uh, hunt and trap. So we'll keep you posted on any activity over there. Stay tuned. Got a visitor with me today. My granddaughter Elena, she got to see a red fox this morning. What else? Coyote. A coyote. It's near the coyote. And of course you'll be seeing that on this video. So, we're, it's rainy here today and uh, sloppy so we had to walk back to this section of, of traps. So we're headed back out to the truck. And going over to a more tolerable place to drive. If I don't fall on my backside. Alrighty. Here we go. Coyote and my snare. And that's those, um, that's those stabilizers that Dustin Drew invented that we made. And notice he's not choked out. second coyote off of this farm. Uh, Tommy caught one down on the corner the other day and I just caught this one come through this trail. Good thing about this here I can move this stabilizer back there in the trail a little further where he maxed this grass and stuff out. So that's all cool. Let me see if I can get over here. 
without getting bit. <laughs> okay. All right, buddy, I'm going to go ahead and uh, tend to this one here. It looks like a pup to me, um, which means there's more. And I've got a couple more snares set down here, so we may have been lucky there, too. All right. Well, there's my snare in the bottom of the fence. I have to stick there so no deer try to come under. And we go down over here to a DP that Tommy set and the masked bandit. <laughs> 